going to attempt to recreate the Dean Lustrous look in her newest movie with James. This time, thumbs up for Jay Dean. I personally am a Jay Dean fan, so don't kill me if I thumbs up this video myself. <laughs> Sa totoo lang, hindi ko pa napapanood yung movie. Pero excited talaga ako manood. If you watch the movie, comment down below. But don't give me any spoilers because I'm still going to watch it. But let me know if you liked it and what you thought about it. Okay guys, paalala lang. I'm not a makeup artist. I'm not a makeup expert. This is an inspired look. It's not an exact duplicate or replica or whatever. But I hope you guys enjoy it anyway. So let's hop right into it. So, ang una kong ginawa, naglagay ako ng moisturizer at foundation. Ang gagamitin ko ay ang Grey Tony Moly Eyebrow Pencil para ma-achieve ang signature brows ni Nadine. Lilinian ko muna ang ilalim ng kilay ko dahil medyo straight yung kilay niya. Pagkatapos ng ilalim, it's time to do the top. So, i-outline lang natin hanggang makuha natin ang desired shape. Pagdating ko sa dulo ng kilay, i-extend ko lang siya ng konti. Now, I will fill in the inner part of my brows, pero light lang para natural lang tignan. Ngayon, ibiblend ko gamit itong spoolie para walang harsh lines. To set my brows, gagamitin ko itong eyebrow gel from Benefit, which is my favorite. Ibibrush ko lang pataas hanggang sa dulo. At pareho lang ang gagawin ko sa kabila. Ngayong pantay na ang aking brows, let's move on to eyeshadow. Sobrang simple lang ang eyeshadow niya, very natural. Para sa base, I'm using this cream shade. Apply ko lang siya sa buong eyelid ko hanggang brow bone. Next, I'm using this coffee color and bringing it halfway into my eyelid. At gagamitin ko din siyang pang-define ng crease. Ang ginagamit ko pala ay itong Sleek Eyeshadow Palette in Oh So Special. Last step ay itong dark brown para sa outer corner ng eyelid. I joke lang! <laughs> Ito pala ang totoong last step. Mag-a-apply ulit tayo ng base color pero sa gitna lang ng eyelid. At syempre sa inner corner ng mata. Para ma-define ang ating lash line, gagamitin ko tong Black Eyeliner Pencil from Revlon. Hindi kailangan perfect kasi ibiblend naman natin siya. Sabi ko sa inyo, ibiblend natin siya. <laughs> sa bottom waterline, gagamitin ko tong light pink eyeliner pencil from Nichido. Ginagamit ko to para ma-brighten ang aking mga mata. With the same eyeliner I used for the top, ilaline ko rin ang lash line ko sa baba. Of course, we gotta curl them lashes. For mascara, gagamitin ko ang paborito kong drugstore product, ang Great Lash by Maybelline. And just like that, we're done with the eyes! At dahil laging namamaga ang cheeks ko, <laughs> kailangan natin ng contour. Ibrush ko lang pababa hanggang sa gitna ng cheeks ko to give it some depth. Ibrush ko rin siya sa aking jawline at forehead. Dahil pango ang nose ko, hindi katulad ng kay Nadine, <laughs> we'll contour that too. I'm just using my fingers for this. Ang Maybelline Cheeky Glow ang gagamitin ko to add some color to my cheeks. <laughs> Pinupokus ko siya sa mansanas ng aking pisngi. Guys, naubusan na ako ng Tagalog! To highlight my cheekbones, I'm using this highlighter from Etude House. Ilalagay ko din siya sa bridge ng ilong, sa noo, at sa baba. Para sa aking mga lips, I'm using this lipstick from L'Oreal sa shade Dewy Beige. At dahil hindi sobrang sakto yung shade, papatungan ko na lang siya ng tinted chapstick. Yay! Tapos na! At 
At dahil wala akong James Reed, una na lang. <laughs> So there you have it. That's my take on her makeup look. What do you guys think? Pasada ba? Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. Also, I'm coming up with really cool and fun videos this summer. So you guys should definitely subscribe so you won't miss out on that. Also, leave your video requests down below because I'd love to see what you guys want to see from me. I will see you guys later and may the wings of your eyeliner always be even. Bye! To attempt to try to... Attempt to try to... It's my take on...